Mike visited the set of the pickup artist in 1985, and we hit it off immediately. Immediately, he was there. immediately. He was there to meet Robert Downey, but he and I ended up walking through Central Park alone that night. And when we broke, when we rapped, which was about four or five in the morning, he and I walked through the park and engaged in a conversation about all of the subjects near and dear to our hearts sex, love, madness, crime, death, and boxing. Jim, the author's self-centered memoir on the great Jim Brown by James Toback, one of the things he's done. But the book overall presents this odd relationship between this white guy, James Toback, and Jim Brown, who was the icon in the black world at the time. So I guess there's a clear parallel now um, I'm a lot older than Mike, I'm a, almost old enough to be Mike's father, where I was a bit younger than Jim. But, but I do feel a real, um, there is a real parallel there, because both of them were substantial, fascinating, tremendously successful, uniquely successful, great athletes and stars. And um, I have been sort of on my own channel of, um, of, um, the self-discovery and uh, I've discovered a lot about myself through each of them and I think perhaps that's gone both ways.